Okay, what's going on everybody? Good evening ladies and gentlemen. My name is D Ken and welcome back to Let's Play Metro Exodus. Now before we continue, please do not forget to hope smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, share this with your boys and your families, follow me on Instagram, smash that bell notification button and enjoy the show. Uh, let's see. Damn. I'll take one of those. Alright, might as well. Oh yeah! Back to the train. See what we can find. Oh shit. Last mag. Catch my breath. <laughs> okay. Last time we checked, uh, Yo, I don't know. Yeah, that's the situation that we're in. Well, where's I hope is all right. Yeah, where is she? Where's my girl? Get over here. Have you found my daughter yet? No. What are you doing here then? Go find her. Okay. The Mirad Sam should be there soon. Leave no stone unturned. If you don't find Anna in half an hour, expand the search area. You got it. And remember, if anything should happen to Anna, I'll never forgive you. Oh, you damn. dragged her into this charade with the jammer and that escape. Why are you even still here, standing around with me? Don't you give a damn about her? Well, of course I do. Damn. For fuck's sakes. Oh shit, you you don't even have any refills, no am or a ammunition, nothing. Okay, now. Found on there yet? Damn. We've been joking about the We'll find her, we'll find her, don't worry, don't worry. Alright, we'll find her. I'm gonna have to um take more of those.
I can't step on that, no. Yeah, you, you can count on that. Um. Oh shit. Um. Let's just head straight there. I know you guys want to eat me, but I don't want you to do that. I have to cross all the way to the other side. What the fuck is this shit? Can I get back to this, please? Thank you. Hey! Hey! Damn! My girl! Come on! Artyom? There you go. I heard you call me. It was so great there. Oh. Don't worry. But I heard you. And couldn't leave you. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Catch your breath. Hey, get that frickin' spider out of my face. It's okay, I'll get you out. What's that?
I've got you, girl. Hold on. Bro. Hold on. This will be over soon. Man. Found it. Well, I got I got hurry up on this. Got you, babe. Hold on, I've got you.
It's good Artyom found me. Oh, thank oh God she's what fine. What is this place? See the barrels? They're chemicals of some kind. This place is either for storage or it's a dump. And that short could have been put there by the locals to mark the spot. Thank you, my love. Oh, of course. Okay. All right. So, uh, Artyom, let's pick her up now? Yep. No way in hell. I can... I can walk just fine. Oh, please, baby. I'll just rest a bit and get going. <laughs> the old man's probably going seven sorts of crazy now, thinking his precious daughter got hurt or something. <laughs> Dad, it's me. My radio battery died. I got it wet. Other than that, I'm fine. Artyom and the guys are here. Head back. Help Stepan persuade my father. About letting Katya and Nastya travel with us. I'll see what I can do. All right, all right. Atyom, I am feeling better now. Really, I am. Okay. So, Sam, tell me what the real uh, enemy bases look like so that we know when, when we see it. First of all, there are these huge human robots. Um, here's what I need. Hold on. I'm very low on uh, ammunition. Here's what we need to. Aha! Yeah, baby. What the hell? Okay, well, let me be serious too. How the hell am I supposed to know how they look now? I haven't seen one in, what, 20 years or so? A fence, some guard towers, patrols, buildings. Bases look like bases. Nothing like that around here. We have yet to see anything even remotely resembling one. But if we do, I'll be sure to go say hi. If I can still remember that. Okay. I'm try to avoid that. I'm gonna move it over here. I could just jump on that. All right, good. Um, can I get some refill, please? Please. <laughs> Seriously, I'm low on ammunition. Glad to see you alive and well, Artyom. Oh uh, yeah. All right. Now, what's the issue here? We have to go back now, I guess. Where... where would you go? Those fanatics would eat you alive! Well... Maybe they... I don't know. I mean, sure, it's not just about the space. We might have to fight our way through the bridge, and even after we do, we don't know what dangers lie ahead. But still! And I told him I could help. I'm a medic. I also told him about the bridge, that it could be lowered. 
Mm. Yes, I even told him about the carriage in the train depot. We came all the way here in it. It's very good. We prepared it for the long trip. Uncle Artem, please, let us come. I will be good. I will help with everything. I will. Uh, oh, no, it's a quick buggy, Uncle Artyom. Oh, don't you worry, Nastya. Uncle Artyom will talk to our commander and sort it all out. Okay. Whoa, Uncle Artyom is more important than that scary commander with metal legs. <laughs> Oh, darling, you can't say that. No, no, you can't say that. Hi, Artyom. Alright, welcome to the crew. Thank you. Won't let you down. Okay. Hey, Artyom. See how it all worked out? Come here, Artyom. Have a seat. Okay. Look, we have an opportunity to cross the bridge without an assault. There are trade caravans going up the river, and the bridge dwellers do business with them. So, disguised as such traders, we will infiltrate the bridge and lower it. Katya says it still works. They won't be able to stop us if we move fast. And should they try, we'll cross it no matter what those fanatics think. They want blood, they will get it. So now, we only have to wait for the traders' boat. Colonel, sir, we can't just leave them here. They will be eaten alive. Sipan, did you ever try using your head? Do you know where we are going? What we are going to face on the way there? Where, pray tell, are they going to sleep on the Aurora? Atop the coal crates? We Spartans can handle it. But for a woman with a six-year-old daughter, no less, this is unacceptable. I'll give them my bedroll and move into the stove. You will fall asleep and get your throat cut the next day you get guard duty after trying to sleep there. Still, I, I know we can't leave them. Let's just collect that carriage Katya told us about while we wait. We can't leave the child here. And anyhow, how long are we going to sleep in turns for? Are you starting that again? How? How are we going to collect that carriage? I'm not taking the Aurora there. Oh, you don't need it. I have a rail car hidden in the terminal. It can tow a carriage like nobody's business. Artyom and I can go get it and, and bring the carriage back. No way I'm letting you go. It will take us both till morning to finish the repairs, and I can't handle it myself in time. Okay, okay, have it your way. I'm done playing the monster here. We get that carriage. We take the civilians with us. Artyom, will you handle this? Listen, Artyom, if the caravan is sighted, drop everything and rush to the port. It's our best chance of traversing the bridge. Thanks, Dad. Katya and Nastya will be so grateful. Here, Artyom, it's this, a breaker this from guy's the a beast. It won't run without this. She's a real babe, Artyom, it's no two ways about it. We went to hell and back, here and I. So much stuff we hold, so... Many tight spots she saved me from. Look, Artyom, since we are going to the terminal, hear me out. It's quite a distance away, and look, if you go at night, there's less of a chance you might run into bandits. They stay at their camps when it's done. Mm. But it's not gonna be easy either, since more beasts come out, and there are also electrical anomalies. The I fanatics remember call them the demons of electricity. So yep. you should think about your options before heading out. Okay. Artyom, Duke is on a mission in that area. He's keeping tabs on the bridge. Reception is bad there. We get mostly static from him. Anyway, if you meet him, he'll update you on the latest developments in the terminal. Okay. I bet you've conspired with Anna and Stepan. Hey, I care for those two no less than you. But we don't know if what's ahead is any better than the fanatics. I guess we'll have to live and see. Okay. All right, all right. Great job persuading the old man. Uh huh. Yeah. Check out my setup here, Artyom. I finally got everything the way I wanted. Really? A proper workbench with storage space for all my tools and some to spare. You can clean your weapons and make ammo for them here, just like with any other workbench you might find. My gun rack is only available here on the Aurora, though. I'll keep samples of every gun you find, and you can exchange them whatever you want. Always in the best working condition. 
oiled and shiny like new. <laughs> oh. You won't have to install any attachments again, though. I am going to make you all competent gunsmiths eventually. Listen, Artyom, I have Fuck something off. for your TR. You can try installing it. Yeah. Use the workbench. Well, I won't keep you here any longer. The fuck? Wait, hold on. What was that? No, 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 no. Oh. That's what it did. Alright. Yeah, we're gonna need some ammo for that. Hold on. Um, alrighty. Let me see this. Anna, thank you and Artyom for helping us. I don't know what would have become of us without you. It is a cursed place. And that's Silentius. Don't thank us before it's all ready to go. It all hangs on Artyom now, so wish him luck. Of course, God bless you, Artyom. Mm -hmm. uh, and you, Stepan, you thank you. Oh, it's... I don't even mention it. Uncle Artyom, Uncle Artyom, are you going on a mission? Yes. Oh. I just wanted to ask. There, where the big tanks are. If you find my teddy bear, just in case you do, could you bring him home? Uh, I'll see what I, I can do. A flying one. It was scary. They live there. It took Teddy to his children. I miss Teddy so much. I'll see what I can do. I, I wanted to go visit Ooh, him, yeah. but Mom won't let me because there are electric demons too. Ooh. I'm telling the truth. They come out at night and they lay up. So pretty. Okay. I actually noticed the difference in my tiha. So it doesn't decrease gradually as it did before. It stays as is. Artyom, uh, are you going to the terminal? Yes. You might meet Duke there. He's got an observation post set up in a carriage near the bridge. Mm. Ask him for a sit trap before mm. going in. Okay. Okay. Um. Oh, actually, it's cut. Oh, okay. Yeah, baby. Son of a bitch. Hi, Artyom. Hey. What the fuck is it? I heard the guitar coming from that tower. It had a nice sound, but the player, oh, he's just atrocious. I know it's dangerous and all, but uh, if a chance presents itself, save the instrument. Listen, I ain't got time for a pity we'll shit like that. Going. Stupid shit on top of it. Oh, uh, Colonel, sir. Uh, we're done already. 
Okay, yeah, go ahead. Get, get the fuck off the car. Uh, I'm just too nice to you all. Alright, as you were. Over and out. Over and out. Oh shit. Uh, that's the whale. Hold on a minute. I gotta get the fuck out. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't like that. When the guitar he was talking about, it was actually over here. like the door ain't coming. So, should we let the sad go? Sure thing. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh. Yeah, Who the fuck? Fuck? Here's the How the fuck can I miss that? How? Oh. Change the position. I give up, man. Fuck you. <laughs> from the father and so I got about halfway and then this got me uh, oh uh, I see uh, one of the heretics but I tell you anyway there is a cashier on this island there is a device but we can use it it's a sin 
Okay. Um, this device is talking about it's here. Also, where's that guitar? I'll just have some rest here before I go back. I'll keep praying for you to this starfish for the rest of my life. He might save your soul. Okay. Turn that off. There's one. Great. Oh shit, a lot of people died. Okay. No. Shit, what's that? Nice. What's up here? Simon, the bridge is done for. The fanatics have taken over. I was prepared to give them a quarter of the cargo, but they wouldn't even hear me out. Wanted me to leave my diesel first and fuck that noise. I'm not pushing the platform with a fucking handcar for 200 clicks. We're neck deep in the red, though. So I'm sending Serge to you with this message. Serge. Sell the diesel to the brothers. They were offering good cash for it. And get that ferry. Or a self-propelled barge Ooh. or a tugboat. Do you understand me, Simon? No haggling. Yeah, he understands me. As soon as the others hear about the bridge, any piece of shit that flows Ooh. will be worth its weight in gold. But we could still bounce. Not bad. Get to it, Simon. Time is money. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, that concludes this episode of Metro Exodus, so thank you very much for watching. Please do not forget to poke smash that like button, subscribe to my channel, share this with your boys and your families, follow me on Instagram, smash that bell notification button, and y'all have a wonderful and blessed evening. Peace out.